Thank you. Oh, you're, f whoa, all right. <laughs> you are way faster. Why don't you help me more often? Well, this is the best part. You get to make a mess. But now we have to fold and clean. Thank you, Mia. Okay, but I know a lot of people do it. I just, I don't know if it looks good in here because everything I have is so light. that I'm working on. Uh, new things up there. I'm sure you can spot what's new. Smile like mama. <laughs> Do I look that silly? <laughs> Do I look that silly? Bye. Good morning, you guys. Happy Sunday. So I'm filming this the day before. It is Saturday and I apologize I didn't get my Friday video up, right? Daddy, Daddy. These girls have been so busy uh, the last few weeks, as you know. So and I'm trying to launch my makeup line. I'm trying to do 100 things at once, so bear with me. Say hi, hi. Mia. Hi. Hi. And these two got their hair cut. Look how cute you look. I love it. And we have, the, now they look more identical because Sophia had the straight bang before and Mia didn't. And now they're matching. So now they look super identical. Um, are you going to say hi again, Mia? Hi. Okay, but you got to look at the camera and say hi. Hi. Oh. You're so cute. And mommy looks like a crazy person this morning, but that's okay. It's okay. I did my a little bit of makeup. I'm wearing my new Aritzia haul, actually. So I have some Levi shorts and just this nice tank. Mia looks super cute. This I got from Old Navy. It's like this really cute little jumper um, tie-dye. And we are going to be doing a closet clean-out. So in today's vlog, I basically wanted to do, go through all my drawers and I have a ton of stuff that I want to donate. I have a ton of stuff that I just want to reorganize. So I'm going to do that today. It's been a mission of mine uh, this last probably a few months because my drawers are insane. But I'm going to show them to you because this is what happens when you have twins, stuff gets thrown. Um, as you know, I'm sure any mom would know. Uh, and then the other thing I want to take you around the house to and just show you all the stuff we've updated. So I've got some new furniture. We have our bonus room, like all the wedding photos up. So I'm going to show you guys that today. Going to roll right into this vlog. I hope you've had an awesome week. It's finally starting to get warmer here in Calgary. Um, so yeah, we've been hanging out outside a lot. We have our patio furniture out. Did we play outside yesterday? Yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. <laughs> this one is, you're a silly girl. You're a silly girl. And Ryan took uh, Mia last time, so now he's taking Sophia to his our, our auto parts store because he's trying to finish off his car, uh, his Chevelle. So they've been doing lots of stuff and they both alternate. It's hilarious. But today we have Mia in Mommy's Glam Room and we're going to do some cleaning and organizing. Ready? Ready. Ready, steady, go! <laughs> we are going to start off with the super fun part. I think Mia's beat me to it. But basically take everything out from all of my drawers. Thank you. Thank you, Mia. Um, we can work on this one after. And I think... I have to try to find another space for my box because I'd re or boxes because I'd really love to utilize these because they're so deep. I could put a ton of stuff in here. And we have... All this happening. So this is like my little hiding spot where like if I'm trying to film, I just hide it and everything gets thrown back here. So we need to organize that. And also I'd like to start getting some things in the top shelves up here. And these drawers need to be completely organized. This is kind of chaotic, but I might as well show you. This is just, yep, yeah, how it looks like in all my drawers right now. We have some new clothes that I just hauled from um, Aritzia, so I wanted to quickly show you guys this. I am obsessed with this Sunday best. I definitely want to buy some more clothes. I have a hoodie um, that you guys would have seen, a light pink one. I posted on Instagram, and I just love, like, some of Tina's clothes are so comfortable. It brings me back to, like, my high school days, but I like the Sunday's best line. Not everything I like from Aritzia, but some stuff I definitely like. And for right now, I just have my Levi shorts on, which I can only wear high-waisted. This is actually a size too big, but that's okay. And I have my just my little top on. Um, all right, we have started, haven't we, Miss Mia? You're ahead of the game. Thank you very much. You keep going. Thank you, Mia. And so these drawers, oh my goodness, I'm so embarrassed. Um, oh, okay, let's make sure. There we go. So we have all my shorts. This isn't so bad. And then what's this one look like? Okay, this isn't too, too bad, but I'd like to move some stuff around. Okay, let's see what, I know this is going to be scary. <sighs> okay. Not terrible, but I definitely have to find some new spaces for all these boxes that I got. And, oh, watch out, baby. Oh, this is definitely like a little, let's throw stuff in here. Drawer. 
Oh my goodness. Okay, yeah. that needs to be organized too. All right. Yeah, that's a mermaid. Thank you, baby. Okay, let's start. You want to start? You say ready, set, go. And this right here is actually my friend's line, Julia, and it's called Ocean Meets Sky. They have the most gorgeous jewelry pieces. So I got like a ton of earrings from them. Oh, be careful, Bubu. Um, that I have to organize and especially these small ones they're so perfect for wearing on a daily basis and then these are really cool they're pins that you can attach to like your purse so I definitely want to try that out and style them but I love their entire like their whole aesthetic is so beautiful and um, lots of you know travel inspo pics and nude colors neutral tones which are my favorite right now okay you grab it <laughs> heart is this? heart show mommy you like, that's mommy's keychain. You like it? Yeah. Wow. Also going to apologize in advance because I can't get this to my editor to get it up. So it's going to be edited by me. It's going to be not so edited and uh, we're not going to do music overlays. So it's kind of just like a, a normal vlog, I guess. But I'm just, here Mia, you want to help mama? We're going to put all this, all the clothes on the floor and we're going to fold them and put them in the right drawers. Okay. Oh my goodness. This is such a messy drawer. Let's do it again. Oh, okay, you're ahead. No, we don't have to do this one. This one's good, actually. That one's all clean. Here, help Mama with this one. Here. Can you do it for Mommy? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you're... F Whoa, all right. <laughs> you are way faster. Why don't you help me more often? Well, this is the best part. You get to make a mess. But now we have to fold and clean. Thank you, Mia. So, this is what's going on now. We're trying on all Mama's shoes. Mia, what shoes are you wearing? Let me see those up close. Wow. You love anything pink, don't you? Okay, so, yeah. This is uh, gonna take me a while, isn't it? With all these little breaks of trying on shoes and... Sit my camera right here. Let's find our pants in here. I'm gonna put all the sweaters, all the big sweaters. No, no, leave that hit there. That's okay. Here, let's do this one. Oops. Okay. Ready? Thank you very much. I think you're blocking the camera, honey. Okay. All right, so basically what I'm gonna do here is I have all these clothes, clearly. Um, so I'm gonna keep my sweaters in the bottom part here. I had a ton of other stuff in there uh, since they are the heavier, deeper drawers. And then this top one here, I'm gonna put shorts. Then the very top, I'm gonna to put like pajamas and bras, underwear and stuff like that. Uh, and get everything folded. Oh, okay. okay, quick distractions here. I found some of my old like little wallets and stuff so Mia's entertained for a minute while I work on this. <laughs> I had a lot of you actually request to do like an ASMR mukbang video so I'm thinking about actually doing one and having us like eat lunch or dinner and we can just chat and like eat a meal I guess. <laughs> I think that'd be kind of cute to do though because the girls are just anytime they eat I'm just in la la land like it's so interesting to me to watch them eat and they enjoy their food so much so I'm like that might be cute to film. Right? But I feel like the last few weeks have honestly been like a massive blur for us because obviously you guys know with with uh, the terrible twos, it came around so fast for us and we weren't prepared. We got hit all at once. They wanted no naps anymore. They, you know, they stay up later. They're more active throughout the day. So we've just, now that it's nice out, we've been taking them outside and just playing like all day long, which is amazing and so helpful because it's definitely not easy, you guys, to film, have a business, work on my makeup line, work on my four other projects that I'm doing right now. And also, you know, just keep sharing my life with you on social media, Instagram. It's just, it's a lot of work sometimes. Whoa, Missy. Look at Mia working hard with my boxes. See, they're reusable. You can use them for other stuff. Good job, Mia. That's why mommy does those boxes, so people can use them for decor or to put other stuff in there. Yes, honey. It was, oh, very nice. Um, there you go. 
Yes, boo boo. Um, I like when I posted on IG though, I told you guys three things about myself that you may not know and one of them being that I'm really into crime shows and so many of you guys are as well. I've been like religiously watching this one girl's channel, Kendall, and she does like, uh, you know, missing persons videos and also people that have been found and do huge documentaries that she puts together and they are so entertaining to watch. And that's always been my secret addiction. Like I love, I grew up watching Law and Order, Criminal Minds, and I could watch that stuff all day long. Sometimes it puts me in like a dark place that I can't sleep and I'm like, oh, I've watched too much. I've consumed too much sadness. And uh, it kind of gets to me sometimes, but I definitely love watching crime. And so many of you guys recommended podcasts for me to watch and things like that. So thank you. And if you have any other um, shows that you watch or documentaries that are good, definitely let me know in the comments. Thank you, my sweet girl. All right, we're going to do shorts. These are actually one of my favorite pairs of shorts. Watch your head, honey. There we go. Um, my favorite pair of shorts. These are the Lululemon ones, and they're so comfortable. I have to buy more, but... Lululemon is not exactly price friendly, but still. And then I have a lot of like tank tops from Lululemon too that are just comfortable. I think I got them when I was pregnant because they were really loose. The, yeah, that's okay. You can put stuff in there. The other thing I said was that I love peanut butter and pickle sandwiches, which a lot of you guys are like, that's gross. But honestly, try it first and then leave me a comment and tell me what you think. They are unbelievable. And my mom... Uh, that would be like one thing that I just like was obsessed with when I was a kid and like she introduced me to it and I introduced it to Ryan and some other friends and they do it all the time and uh, Right? Yes. Okay before my brain stops. Let's make sure we get all the shorts um, I also have a lot of like these kind of sweaters that I got from Lulu, which is really nice They're kind of more tight than I'd like to wear right now because right now I'm just like I want comfy clothes and only comfy clothes, but I'm gonna put leggings and shorts in this drawer and workout clothes, so. And then I'll kind of go through clothes that I'm giving away. And usually like if we give clothes away, we'll just get all our stuff together and the kids stuff and just do a big donation. Um, that's a little bit easier than going back and forth, back and forth. How the heck? Okay, there we go. So I'm planning on filming a Mother's Day gift guide and it will introduce my new makeup line which I'm really excited about. I want to say the makeup line will launch May 20th, like around that date, but I'm not doing it set in stone yet, but I, like we are really close. So I'm going to uh, start posting sneak peeks today and sharing that with you guys because I'm so excited. Oh, I also bought these. These are the only uh, shorts that I will wear, the high-waisted Levi. So a lot of you guys must be on Instagram saying you're going to check them out. And honestly, I'm not kidding. If like, especially with me, like my stomach just looks like, I don't know if you can tell, but I have like, yeah, a little bit of flubby skin there from the pregnancy. Um, these are really nice. I only wear anything high-waisted or else it all just like hangs out. Um, so these are really flattering and I really really do love wearing them So they have them in so many different colors and they are a bit more expensive, but I mean you only need one really good pair of shorts um, Oh These are like some other shorts I have which I don't really wear anymore I'm not really into like super light shorts like that anymore, but actually let's put jean shorts here Garage also has really nice jean shorts There And not that we've gone to any fancy dinners lately. I think Ryan was talking about doing a brunch for Mother's Day. Um, and there's a place that we go to all the time here and they have a nice patio. But yeah, I have really nice dressy shorts, which I like too. These are all from Dynamite. Ooh. Mommy, help me. You can do it, baby. Yeah. Yes, you can. Um, so yeah, let me know what your Mother's Day plans are, what you guys are going to do. Hold on, let me finish this, then I'll help you. Here. There you go. You're welcome. Um, okay, got these shorts. One down, the rest to go. So we have sh jean shorts, other shorts, leggings, and like workout sweaters. Because I'm going to start running again very soon. What are we working on over here? Oh, all right. Thank you. Thank you. Ah! 
All right, back to it. Thank you, my lovely Mia. Okay, tank tops. Thank you, Mia. You're doing a really good job. This is Which one? A dessert. Wow. And update on just life in general. I feel like I've been trying to manage the balance of baby toddlers at home and business a little bit more now because I, when we were like, okay, what is the terrible twos? We had a really good first half of the year with them and then it hit hard like a month ago and we were like, oh my goodness, this is a lot more work, and especially since you found a picture. Wow. But yeah, we don't have any help from anybody and we haven't seen our both our parents for almost a year. So it's been, we've had to do a lot of teamwork. Basically, you just have to communicate a lot and alternate. Like if you're doing it at home with just your husband, like you guys have to work out a schedule and something where you both have some alone time and then some time together and then also just, um, you know, when you need that 10 minute break or that drive to Starbucks that the other one understands. So Ryan and I have like a solid understanding. Like he's so awesome. Like if I'm like Ryan, like I do 20 minutes, like he will give me 20 minutes and he doesn't complain. So I think, I don't know, he's just such an awesome dad and we obviously get in normal arguments like any other couple would get into, but it's never about, oh, you have more time than me or stuff like that. Like we've never gotten into a fight about that. And it's kind of nice having that, um, that teamwork while we kind of figure out, I guess, moving forward, what we're going to do for the next year. So we may get a babysitter, which just one of our neighbors has offered. So we might take up that offer and it would be like her first little job. So I feel like that would be really nice and just help out because we'll be at home, but just for us to clean, we don't have a cleaner. So just have some more time to clean or a few hours just to ourselves. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think it'll be really, really nice and life changing for us. So we may do that because um, we, we, we don't really need a nanny. And Ryan always says, why does everyone say to get a nanny? He's like, I am the nanny. Like I do all the work with the girls. So it is true like we don't really need a nanny since Ryan's with the girls and he's so great with them they're so attached to Ryan more so attached to me and I just think that's a mommy thing and they always are by my side and um Ryan's very helpful though he'll take one to have so, um some alone time if they get like that because they get like that a lot they're they just fight over my time so much and then me I'm just like I want alone time <laughs> wow honey yes this is mommy's first brush set you guys want to see yeah you want to have it? Yeah. There you go. You put it in there and put some other stuff in there. Um, but yeah, anyways, I just wanted to update you guys on that because um, obviously I wish I could film more, but I'm just not at that point where I can. Am I blurry? I don't think I'm blurry. Anyways, your hair looks so cute. And I couldn't believe yesterday I was FaceTiming with my mom quickly to show the girls playing soccer and their hair looked blonde, like super blonde in the sun. I feel like it's going to lighten even more. It's so beautiful. Such beautiful hair. Mommy, you're so jealous, baby. Beautiful, beautiful hair. I love their hair so much. Um, anyways, yeah, so I just wanted to update you guys on just life, I guess, in general. It's been busy, but manageable. And I'm just excited. I'm going to start running again, getting a regular solid routine down on working out. And you guys have been asking me, like, what's your workout routine? Honestly, like these veins, these muscles are all from those two girls. I swear, swear on my life. That is it. Um, Cause I don't work out. I hardly work out. I maybe work out on our machine. I don't even know, 20 minutes a week. That's it. <laughs> like nothing. Um, same with Ryan works out, but his car is his workout. He works out at night on his car and just does, you know, car stuff that I don't even know what he's doing, to be honest. I don't know how cars, like when you're building one yourself and when you're revamping it, I have no idea what he does, but I had to go in there and help him the other day and just, um, put my foot on the, the gas and I think he was working on the gas and the brakes and stuff. But anyways, yeah. So that's kind of, I'm trying to find a hobby for myself though, because Ryan's hobby is his garage and the car and me. Like I don't, I don't know. I don't sit in here. I don't like look at my stuff. <laughs> I, uh, I would say like Netflix and watching crime shows and just, I guess shows in general has been my thing. Mia, where are you going? You got to help mama. Max, why don't we see Max's haircut? Max got a haircut yesterday too. Mia, Mia got a haircut. Come show me. Wow, can you do a spin? 
Can you do a spin? It's beautiful, Mia. Wow. You look so beautiful. Wow. Hey. Yes, honey. What do you have? Oh, picture. Yep. Good job. Mommy's going to do this top half right here. Oh, goodness. Okay. Let's get tank tops. That's picture, honey. All right. Well, do you want to help mommy over here? Uh, so I'm putting tank tops, I'm just folding them into this first drawer here because I feel like summertime is what I'm going to be reaching for the most. All right, so she is watching some cartoons right now. Um, but the other thing is I'm happy because uh, they haven't canceled soccer, which starts in a few weeks. And if I could give you guys any tip, if you have like toddlers and you're going crazy at home trying to figure things out, I honestly, what has worked the most for the girls has just been taking them on long walks and taking them to the pond and just having them walk even. Like, is it just kills such so much energy and I really highly recommend it if they're not sleeping through the night. Since we've done that and since it's been nice out, the girls have been sleeping through the night from 7 o'clock until about, they sometimes come in at like 6 or 7 and we'll throw on TV for a little bit and then feed them, give them breakfast. Um, but that's helped so much. Like, Ryan and I are both like... Woo, we're getting back to our routine and schedule because for the last month we've just been having a really difficult time so and I think more than ever like you really need to communicate with your hubby and just tell him like you know that you need the extra hands and extra help if you don't have family to help you out um, another thing which is crazy I know I'm kind of like in an awkward position but that's fine while I finish this um, all my friends are turning 30 this year and so am I. It's such a crazy thing. Like I got sent this thing yesterday. I don't want to say which friend just in case she's watching this video. Um, but, or I have two birthdays next month of my friends, uh, 30th, but, um, it was this little thing to fill out and you had to put old photos and it just, wow. Like it's so crazy to think back to like when I was 18, 17, I was so different. And, um, someone asked me on Instagram actually if I'm, in or introverted or extroverted and I for sure would say before I was an extrovert and now introvert because like I stay home I love staying home I'm f such a family person and before I honestly was like the life of the party wanted to go out all the time social butterfly like it put me in a room of people and I'm like the one screaming basically it's like night and day it's so opposite so let me know what you are down below in the comments but I feel like when you have a family and when you have kids, like you tone down so much. And even when Ryan was like, when I met you, you were like off the walls, crazy. You were like just so chatty. And of course, you know, I am chatty, but in a different, like in a different way now. Um, oh my goodness, you guys can't even bend anymore. But yeah, I have lots of cute little tank tops. So let me know if you want me to do like a summer try on video of some of my favorite outfits. Maybe I can do a haul. This goes here. Okay, any more tank tops? We've got, wow, I have a lot of tank tops. Thank you, boo-boo. Are you gonna watch some cartoons? Yeah. Your ABCs, they can count up to 20 and they know their ABCs. Um, not all their ABCs, but they are so good with numbers, it's unbelievable. I can't believe. And I have, I'm so excited for their third party. I'm definitely going to do something like throw an outdoor party since we have a big backyard and um, I know the theme so I wonder if I should tell you guys now. I'm just so excited. Oh, I think I'll wait a little bit but I will be announcing it shortly. I'm so excited. Then you guys can help me with like ideas on what else to do but I'll have the balloons as last year and the catering and all that stuff that I did. Oh, I like to do like despite COVID I still like to celebrate you know, their birthdays, because that only happens once. So, you know, obviously with us still being safe and we don't see that many people, we keep a close group of friends. I still want to celebrate their birthdays. Like I cannot imagine not celebrating one of their birthdays, more so than mine. Even though it's my 30th this year, I'd rather celebrate their third birthday than my 30th, because that brings me more joy. Like honestly, it does. And <laughs> I feel like I'm getting old, honestly. 30 is like... So people are so excited for 30. I'm like, no, like, oh, it's such a crazy thing. I feel like I'm not ready for it, but. And I appreciate you guys so much. I know on a few of my last videos, people have been saying that my videos are just like, it's always the same, same vlog, same thing, blah, blah, blah. 
and I just do what I love. Like I want to just film when I can, chit chat, do some organizing, share things with you and have you guys share things with me down in the comments. Like it's just what I've been doing the last seven years. So why would I, you know, and some people do videos where it's just like talking about one thing and I do multiple things in my videos. So I just think it's different. I don't think people understand what vlogs are because they're like, I guess the newer way of filming and they're exciting. I feel like vlogs are fun to watch. Let me know. Like, do, would you rather have me do like a, like a 10 to 15 minute like video on like a product or on just one thing like some people do or like a vlog of like so many things. What do you guys like watching? I prefer vlogs, honestly. I am actually pr proud of myself. We are getting somewhere, look at that. So of course you can tell I have so many nudes and pinks for tank tops, white. I just tend to wear the same sort of colors. Some of these are like camis, some of these I wear to bed. Um, and then just some cute little tanks. Gotta find all my underwear. Getting there. Oh, okay, you're there. It got suspiciously quiet, Mia. You're watching some TV? Oh, oh, all right, okay. Where are you going? Okay, I'm almost done here on this side and then we can string on the other side. And then I think I'm gonna have some lunch with Mia, so maybe I'll be filming that too. We'll see how it goes. This drawer here, I just have jeans, so I'm just gonna do light jeans on this side and dark jeans. There we go. Not so bad, let's put these actually in the bottom drawer. Actually, what? are in the bottom drawer, okay. Put a little piece of hair. Oh, got sweatpants. Okay, well, we have a little hungry break here. We're gonna take a little break, eat something. Are you ready? Come in, let's go. Seven. Seven? Eight. Good job. Good job. Be very careful, Mia. Uh, flowers, these are new from Home Sense. I can't remember if I had shown you guys these, but they're so beautiful. I wanna find some other little like knickknacks to put here, but um, we have a really nice family photo shoot right here. Just put two photos. And then, um, yeah, and me, or they can't reach this yet. It's a little bit further back, but a little worrisome, but it's really pretty for now. So until I find another spot for it. I also got this little plant right here uh, from Home Sense, which I really liked. I think it's really nice for the kitchen. We have a little candle and a book out. I like to keep it pretty empty, but I was really happy I found this because I think it's really nice. Daddy and sister are back. Are you gonna go say hi? Go say hi, Daddy. Hi daddy. Hi, daddy. Hi, daddy. I almost forgot to show your haircut. Maxie, let's see. Oh, look at you go. Oh, look at that fresh bum. <laughs> and then these little side tables. These have been so awesome. Um, I didn't want to do big, like, tables just so, you know, when the girls are walking through to get onto the couch, they're not, like, hitting themselves. But these are nice because you can move them so easily. So if I'm, like, watching some TV, laying down, I just put my drink right there. If it's tea, wine, whatever I'm having. Um, and it's really helpful. Like, right there see so I was sitting here yesterday and it's just really nice and easy and simple so I think those were around 100 each from Amazon or sorry not Amazon home sense they're really beautiful and they almost look like acrylic hi beauty mommy's gonna go into her office really quick yes oh so I asked our builder for a lock on this door yes your office your office I'm pretty sure it's mommy's office yes honey okay so um, obviously you can see lots of new things that I'm working on, uh, new things up there. I'm sure you can spot what's new and it's actually pretty clean in here, which I'm happy about. Uh, but yeah, I have lots of work to do behind the scenes. That's why I, I thought today would be an awesome time for the closet. And then I also put some flowers over here. Not that you guys ever see them. And this is just a mess. Got my printer out. I usually have it hidden, but... I was just in a rush, it was tax season and just getting everything done behind the scenes. So lots of work, my little boo-boo. Are we gonna eat something then go back upstairs? No. And we have, what do I have here? Yeah, I still have all my decor in here, which is really nice that you guys have seen already. This little table too is from Wayfair. So you could put like this, or you could put like floral on here or like just like little decor pieces, whatever you want. But I just really like it for storing some of my product. Right, Mia? Okay, let's go work. Can we go work upstairs? No. No? Why not? Hello. What did you want to do? Work here? Yeah. What does mommy do? What do we work for? Money. Mommy works for the money. Yeah, work the money. 
Mia works for the money. I just said Mama works for the money. No, Mommy works for Okay, Mia, you want to start working now. You're pretty young, but I guess we can stretch you early. How cute is that? I put a little photo of the girls in there. We've got some new... Gosh, I hate showing all my new stuff because people spot it all the time, but I usually have it out, but it's okay. Okay, are you spinning? Okay, let's go eat something. Let's go have some lunch. Let's go have some yummies. Come on. See, these are the interruptions I have all throughout the day. Yes, I'll see what we have. Let's see. Let's see. Hold on. Uh, we have eggs, bagels, strawberries, blueberries, peppers. Okay, Ryan is making lunch for the girls right now. They just got back. So I'm going to quickly finish up this side so we can work on the other side and just put everything away. Also, I'm just starting off a pile of stuff I'm not wearing anymore or donating, so I'm just going to put that over there. And then also these pink pants. So these, I remember getting these um, a long time ago, and I just wouldn't wear them again. Even though they're pink, they're really nice, but I just wouldn't wear them, so I'm going to put them there. Okay, so you can see the carpet now, which is a good sign. So I'm going to show you guys all the drawers like once I reveal everything at the end. So on this side here, I do have a few cubbies that have, oh my gosh, there's so much stuff. Um, these actually have to be moved somewhere else, but clothes under here that are kind of like miscellaneous colors that I didn't want to put with the other clothes. So I think a ton of this stuff is stuff that I'm giving away to. I swear you can find organizers all over my house, makeup organizers. Since I have so many drawers, I didn't need these. So I'm gonna have to figure out what I wanna do with these, but. This is a cute summer top. I'll keep that. Don't think I would wear this again. Let's put that in. I just, my style has changed so much over the years. I don't think I would wear this, so. I don't think I'd wear this again either. What do we have? Eggies. Eggies? What else? Mm, yummy. Miss Sophia doesn't like to eat with, with her clothes on. <laughs> no, Mia does. Mia has a nice little pink outfit on, don't you? No, big toe. That's big toast. That's a bagel. Mm. Mia, the bag's on. Yeah, big bite, Mia. Sister says big bite. Hi, Maxie. Did Sophia say she missed you yesterday when you came home from your haircut? Yeah, you've had a good nap. Oh, you're falling asleep, aren't you? Oh, that's a good boy. That's a good boy. Might as well show you guys this now before I go back into the closet, but this is our little bonus area, family room. Now it's not done, that's why I haven't really shown it, but. I know I shared our wedding shots on Instagram with you guys. They turned out so nice. Oh, I love it. Little photo wall. It really has made this room so much more completed. There's so many nice memories on the wall. Also, I had some questions on the couch. The couch is from Wayfair, so I can link it for you guys down below. And also, um, these photo frames are also from Wayfair. And then a few things we're doing. So on this side right here, um, we're gonna be doing custom built-ins. So we talked to our builder and um, it'll be really nice for like books, decor, even she said like a little work desk area for the girls to do homework. And then on here, we're gonna do a custom cushion for our bench that we got made. So all of it will be together soon enough. And then also this will be moved. This won't be here. We just did that for now. Um, we'll have a big carpet, a big, big ottoman, and this will kind of just be a nice like family reading room. 
And she also recommended to do a built-in, kind of like the one in our basement where if we ever wanted a TV, we can put one. So that was actually a really smart idea too. So that's what we're gonna do. I also found this little tray from HomeSense. So this was really cute, plus another sand and fog candle. I love their candle so much. I got one for the basement as well. And then just this little flower in the back here. And then this is also new. We have a picture of a chandelier. This is just like our little area with our mini fridge. So I've been looking for things to have for like little decorations and I just really love it. All right, back to it. So <laughs> little girls are having their bellies fed right now, which is good, lots of energy. Uh, so right here, we just have all the outfits that I will be keeping in there. And you know what? I think I'm gonna make my wig drawer in the master bathroom so I can utilize this entire drawer because I only wear two of the wigs, which are the Freedom Couture, which you guys have already seen. This one, it's beautiful. Um, Bellamy ones, I honestly don't wear anymore. I have my big mirror right here too. So I'm gonna put that there. And these, I don't know, these I'll put into a drawer till I figure out what I'm gonna do with them, but I really think I can utilize this drawer a little bit better than I have been. Okay, I'm having one of these right now. These are so addicting, and I got them because the girls always have those little yogurts, and then they have these ones, um, and I just love them. They're so good, they're so tasty. Quick little power drink, yogurt. Which I Okay, I'm in the master bathroom, so I can probably fit it in my little hair drawer here. I have so many hairbrushes. Uh. Uh. Everywhere. Hairbrushes. Okay, I'm gonna put those up here. Okay, so it's like a little French braid that you can put on your head. It looks really nice and it almost makes it look less like a wig as well. Um, some wig things in there. Okay, so we are going to dedicate both of these to jewelry and I just feel like it's way more organized. I had these double stacked before, but it's much easier just having it all laid out. And then I have my two smaller ones just on the ends here. So now I can put like all my new jewelry into this right here and see where everything is. And another thing too, I've kept so many little boxes that I don't need anymore, like Pandora and stuff like that. So those are just gonna get thrown away. I don't need those anymore. Um, and yeah, all of these are from HomeSense as well. Like these are awesome. I love storing my jewelry in here and this one's the beige. I also have pink. This one's from Amazon. And if you wanted to see the inside, I still do have lots of jewelry in there. So I'm gonna actually double stack these. I think that looks a little better. And then you can put like rings or studs or whatever you want in here. And then these ones are brand new. So I got these, I wanna say a few months ago. I just haven't used them yet. So they're stacking trays. They are acrylic and you can see everything, uh, which is really nice. So it comes in a set of three and they stack. So I got six. Look what I just found. So I actually got this at Pandora a few years ago when the girls were born. So mother daughter, so cute. Uh, definitely a cute little gift for Mother's Day. I am gonna keep it on like the black little thing it came with and put it right like that so I can display it. Hi Mia, you're back. How was your lunch? Yummy. It was yummy, that's good. Mommy's doing a good job, huh? Maya. <laughs> Maya. Mommy did lots. Look how much she's done today. Wow. Be careful with mommy's necklace, okay? It's very heavy. Heavy? Heavy. 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 <laughs> heavy. 
Okay, so I am basically taking off all the little studs and putting them away because I don't need the little back part. Here. Thank you, little helper. And now it's going to start raining. It's getting very cloudy outside now. And this is taking me three hours. This is not coming off. Let's do the little ones. There's a, little, a lot on this one. Are you trying on mommy's sunglasses? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Look what I just found. The prototypes Ow! for my makeup case. Originally when I was going to do more of like a salmon pink, then we ended up doing a light pink. And you guys have seen like the, the plaque that I put on here, the gold plaque. My goodness. Okay. I think we are going to end it here. I have this deep drawer that I haven't finished yet, but I'm going to finish it and then just show you guys like an overall look at everything. It's getting a little crazy. It's getting a little crazy in here. Oh my goodness. Okay. I think I did a pretty good job considering I had Mia in here for 90% of the time. Um, but I wanted to show you, I also got all these boxes like House of CB, Joe Malone that I'm getting rid of as well. They were just so much clutter in here and I have to just clear out this space over here. So we did pretty good. There's still just a few more things back here that I have to find where to put those big boxes. But of course I keep all my Chanel boxes and anytime that you plan on reselling, it's just really smart to keep the box and um, the big bag, but I mean, they take up a ton of room. So I wanted to show you guys what I was able to complete. I think I did an awesome job. So let me show you quickly. Start off with the first drawer. So we have all my tank tops in here folded. Colors are together and everything just looks so organized. So I have that one and I have this one right here. So we have shorts, we have dressier shorts, leggings and workout clothes. The bottom here we have big sweaters and here we have, this I didn't really have to reorganize, we just have like all my skirts, long skirts. And then this one here we have jeans. And the very bottom we have sweatpants and just comfy pants. Now on the other side, we have all my jewelry. So I'm really excited about this. I'm gonna play around a little bit more with it so it's like super, super organized but i think it did a pretty good job for only having the little time i had but if you want to see a full jewelry collection please let me know in the comments we have a nice little stephanie necklace and hair accessories watches um pandora a bunch of random jewelry and then in the bottom here we have this is very empty so i just have my sunglasses and until i have more jewelry to figure out what i'm doing with the acrylic ones and then the bottom here this is just really miscellaneous um and then this one here is nice and organized and then the bottom one is just the clothes now these I'm still using for my boxes unless I can find somewhere else to put them in the house and I don't really want to display them just because I could display a few of my Chanel ones actually but I just feel like it changes the color completely in here especially if I put like the orange boxes don't you guys think or should I put like a few Chanel boxes up there let me I just kind of wanted to see what that would look like with maybe like a little shopping bag and like two Chanel boxes up there I don't know. I feel like I'm thrown off by the color, but let me know your thoughts if you think I should put like shopping bags and boxes up at the top here or decor, stick to decor. I just have not found anything that I like yet. Uh, I know I've asked you guys in previous videos, but I'm kind of stuck on that until, you know, my bag collection grows or I have something else to put up there. Okay, so it looks something like that. I wanted to quickly show you what your thoughts are on shopping bags. I don't know. I don't know if I'm liking it or not. It's okay, but I know a lot of people do it. I just, I don't know if it looks good in here because everything I have is so light, but let me know what you guys are thinking. Okay, so this is where I'm gonna end today's vlog, sweaty and tired, and I need another coffee. Uh, but I was really excited to film today and I just love watching these types of videos, like organizing vlogs, music lists, and just like really chill. So I think I'm gonna start doing more videos like this so I can get more content up for you because obviously you know it takes so much time to film videos and it can take more than one day. So just to get like some shorter vlogs up for you, I think I'm gonna start doing that. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it motivated you to start like organizing cleaning and I'm really excited for summer as you can tell I have a lot of like summer clothes uh, so I think I'm gonna do another haul from Aritzia and a few stores here like Dynamite plus Princess Polly and some ones that are in the States 
um, and then show you guys like some try on outfits or something. Maybe I'll do that with me and Sophia because they love trying on clothes. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed seeing the girls. It's crazy how big they are right now, right? Like I've been getting so many messages like they keep growing and growing and I totally see it. They're chatting so much more. They're trying on my clothes, my sunglasses. It's just so crazy and my shoes. Um, but they're so adorable and it's just so excited or exciting to see them grow. Uh, but thank you guys for listening to my chat today too. You guys know I love to talk to you. So let me know how you've been doing. What do you have planned for the summer? I know everywhere is kind of different, I guess, with vac being vaccinated. I'm actually still unable to. Uh, Ryan is because he's diabetic, but I can't, I think, until, I think it's June. But we're kind of late here in Canada. Uh, but yeah, let me know, I guess, what you're able to do, what you're not able to do. If you guys are planning on traveling throughout the summer, um, just keep catch me up I guess uh, and my next vlog I'm gonna show you guys my makeup line and also talk to you guys about some um, Mother's Day gift ideas and kind of like what I'm planning on doing what I like specifically and um, hopefully in the next video I'll have my nails done too because I'm really wanting to go get my nails done anyways I hope you enjoyed today's video of course if you have not yet subscribed to my channel subscribe now and I will see you guys in the next vlog